Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to check a very interesting problem asked to define one-on-one -on -one relationship between parent and child. It is an advanced level data engineering interview question which was asked in Tiger Analytics. Now as you can see from the given data that we have multiple parent and child IDs available with their age and we are asked to link every child with one parent to make a pair. The linking should be based on their age where child should be start from their highest age and it should be linked with the parent who is having highest age. So let's check how we can solve this problem. So as you can see that we don't have any IDs available here for making the relationship or for, for joining the parent with its child. So very first what I'll gonna do is I'll create a row number for my every parent ID and my child IDs and based on those IDs generated from row number I'll join them to get my expected output so let's check that so very first I'll define a window specification function here window function row number I'll specify here so I'll name it as window P and I use my window function here I have to partition it on my category So I just mention here category then order by now I have to order my age descendingly so I'll just write here column value is my age column and I'll do it descending then I'll store this result in one of my data frame called df result p it's equals to df dot I'll use with column to get a name for my newly added row number column so I'll name it as my rnp then I'll use my row number function here I'll define my row number and in my over close I'll specify my this window function so now df dot row number then this this okay I'll define this and then I have to get this number on my parent ID so I'll filter it here and I'll only fetch my category having adult or parent available so I'll just write here where my category should be equal to category should be equal to adult and I'll select my required columns from this data frame so I am looking for my IDs age and the row number we received here so I'll just write here I'll give an alias to every column I'll give my alias as my p underscore id as my parent id then my age column as my p underscore h and my this newly added row number p column let's check if we have any syntax error or else what is the output we are getting in my data frame so i'll just display it okay 
so it's executed now now you can see that based on my age it is given in number two every row so for every parent i received an id id here now same thing i'll apply to my child also so let me copy this same section and i'll make the required changes in the same section so what i'll do now here i'll define this function with windows c i'll partition it on category only order by value descending only df result instead at place of p i will write here c and i'll give this name as rn c row number based on that window function at place of p i'll define c here then filter category should be my child so i'll write here it should be my child category required columns i'll select and i'll give name as c dot id c underscore id c underscore h and my ID column let's check what is the output we are getting here so i'll display it and let's check okay so now you can see based on the age highest to lowest order we received four ids with every child so this is how we got here two data frames one with parent ids and another with with child ids now simply i'll join it and i'll get my desired output so let's check how we can proceed so i'll create a new data frame here df join or my df underscore final and i'll join here so as we have to link every parent with its child so it may happen that there should be any parent who is having no child linked so for that reason i'll use here left join and very first on the left side i'll use my data frame parent So I'll mention here dot join it with my C based on the column row number. So I'll write here column should be RNP is equals to call RNC and here i'll mention my type of join so i'm using left join so i'll just write here left and let's see what is the output we are getting here so i'll just display my final data frame okay now you'll see that we received here id category value rc is equals to null so i'll just select the required columns from my this data frame so as i'm looking for age column and their parent and child ids column so i'll just select those required columns here so let me select so it was my pid then so it was my pid then it was my p underscore age then it was my let me copy this and i'll <coughs> at place of p i'll just do it c and c let's check what is the output we are getting now so now as you can see that i have selected my required columns here and the output we received here is my parent id their age my child child id and age of those childs so here 51 is the highest age of a parent and it was linked with 22nd age of child so this is how i created a relationship between parent and child and i created a pair with their required ages thank you for watching this video I hope you understand the logic we have used here. Please like and share this video with the guys who are preparing for data engineering interviews or those who are sharpening their data engineering skills. 
subscribe the channel as i am coming with more data engineering interview questions and solutions thank you